something else that I uh, counsel young couples with young kids about in this. And, you know, some of them might be thinking, hey, Tom, you know what? We're a young couple. We've only been married and you've got a child and we don't have anything. We don't have any equity. We don't have any money to bank. I, I understand that. I get that. But having your first child, the responsible adult thing is to do is, number one, Talk about getting your estate planning done. Mm -hmm. Number two, level term life insurance. Mm -hmm. It has just got to be part of your budget to have level term life insurance. It is, number one, is so inexpensive. You can buy it over the internet. Term, term. But you mm -hmm. need to think in terms of, okay, if both mom and dad pass away and you're giving your kids your sister to take care of, you better have some life insurance so it's not a financial strain on her. Exactly. And then number two, if you're a married couple and you need to have life insurance because if the husband passed away and he's a he's a bread earner, boy, you better have life insurance to make up for that lost income. And even if the mom's a stay at home stay at home mom, Doesn't matter. you better have life insurance on her because if she's not there to take care of the kids, you're gonna be putting them in some kind of daycare. Exactly. So no matter what your situation is, if you've got young kids, you need to have level term life insurance. And the good news is it is not expensive. Correct. There are many choices out there. And we obviously are asked this question quite a bit. And of course, we are the ones that are promoting that it part of your budgeting, part of your planning is to have term life insurance. And you need to factor that in. And that's how... Even if you did not have other assets, it does not matter. But the term life insurance is what would fund your estate if you were to pass away. And that's how the money would be there for your young children. So again, you don't have to feel that you have to have a lot of money or this in order to do these documents. No, it's about making sure that things are set up so that number one, the people that you want to take care of your young children that they are able to do it because of these legal documents. Number two, who you want to be in charge of the money for your young children. It may be different than the people that are having them day to day. And number three, the funding, which even if you don't have another penny, would be term life insurance.